Over the course of his career, Tom Jones has collected enough women's underwear to launch his own line of lingerie. At the height of his career in the 60s and 70s, his stage performances were supposedly so hot and raunchy that his female fans would throw their knickers on stage. Now in his 60s, he's still getting out on the road. I love to sing. The, the best part of my day is when I'm on stage at night. You know, that's, that's the most exciting part of my day because it, I can, um, you can get rid of a lot of emotion. And although the knickers might be a little larger these days, he's still treating fans to the same raucous style that made him famous. Yeah, well I've always, you know, I've stuck to my guns. I've, I've always sung the way I wanted to. And I've worked with a lot of different producers to get different sounds, but never changed my vocal style. And thank God it's still being appreciated. Early on in his career, sticking to his guns meant ignoring the advice of one of his idols. You know, Frank Sinatra once told me, he said, you give too much, you're going to lose your voice. I said, it's the only way I know how to sing. After a quiet patch in the late 70s and early 80s, his son Mark became his manager. And in 1987, Tom bounced back into the charts with a cover of the Prince hit Kiss. In 1999, he capitalised on his retro cool by pairing up with a host of younger chart-topping artists to cover a range of hits on his blockbuster album Reload. Four years later, he popped up again with Reloaded. It's basically the greatest hits album, so we've, we've taken um, the most successful singles that I've had, and then... Um, I've had success with, uh, with some CDs that we've put out in Europe that were never released in, in America. So we added some of those uh, songs as well. The hits kept coming and so did the awards. In 2002, he was honored to be singled out by Q Magazine for a Merit Award. The following year, he got a Brit for outstanding contribution to music. But after you've been around for, uh, for a long time, it's, it's nice to know that uh, that the industry appreciates what, what, I've, what I've done.